Whenever extreme Muslims are condemned in the media, they turn around and play the innocent card. And in this case, they have called me a fake Muslim imam or a sheikh only because I expose their intentions to create a caliphate within Australia. I am considered a fake because I condemn terrorism. I'm considered a fake because I oppose and expose extremism. I'm considered a fake because I filter Islamic texts before accepting them. I'm considered a fake because I respect Queen Elizabeth. I'm considered a fake because I say law of the land comes above all laws. I'm considered a fake because I would die for Australia. I'm considered a fake because I live by the Australian constitution. I'm considered a fake because I glorify the Australian flag. I'm considered a fake because I believe all departed Australian soldiers are martyrs in the eyes of God and in heaven. I'm considered a fake because I reject Sharia law and live by the Australian law. I'm considered a fake because I am an Australian Muslim and not a Muslim Australian. I'm considered a fake because I believe religion was sent to serve humanity and humanity does not serve the religion. I'm considered a fake because I have Jewish friends and Christians too. I'm considered a fake because I don't charge $1,500 for a marriage contract or for a divorce and I do everything for free. I'm considered a fake because I reject all Islamic governments and Islamic caliphates. I'm considered a fake because I believe God sent religions to guide people, not to rule upon them by the sword. I'm considered a fake because I want an Islam that is compatible with the West. I'm considered a fake because I have left certain unacceptable Muslim practices and self-harming rituals. I'm considered a fake because I don't agree with such a Muslim upbringing. I'm considered fake because I refuse to conduct marriage contracts for underage children, which is becoming the encouraged norm within the Muslim society. I'm considered a fake because I reject the idea of genital mutilation. I'm considered fake because I am against stoning. I'm considered fake because I want to reform the religion within. I'm considered fake because I have woken up before it's too late. I'm considered fake because I am a free thinker. I'm considered fake because I use the brain God gave me, something that is frowned upon by most clergymen. I'm considered a fake because they know I am right and it doesn't serve their agendas at all. I'm considered a fake because until now, none of them have the ability or courage to debate me on what I state and believe in. I'm considered a fake because I didn't accept their $3 million bribe to stay silent. I'm considered a fake because for them, I'm too Australian. There were plenty of careers that I could have chosen in my life, but I chose to become the person I am today, to give back to Australia. The bottom line is, I want Australia to stay Australian.